time, let's make a paper helicopter. How do you think it works? Get your hands warmed up and your lab coat on. Hey, don't be scared, Pooch. It's just our paperclip snake. For this make, you'll also need your choice of coloured card, tape, a ruler, markers, a pencil and some scissors. Start off with the card, ruler and pencil. Using your pencil or a marker, measure out a long rectangle shape. This can be any size you want. Then grab your scissors and cut this out. Using your marker and your ruler again, mark out the halfway point at the top and divide the bottom into thirds. Then about halfway down, measure a line across. A couple of centimetres under that, measure and draw two dotted lines that connect to your bottom markers, just like this. Then draw another dotted line straight down from the top. Now that you have your template, grab your scissors. Ah, what? What's going on? Whoa, that was weird. Now I have my scissors cut along the dotted lines. Be careful not to cut all the way across. Now grab some coloured markers or anything you'd like and decorate your helicopter. Lay your helicopter down and fold down this blade. Turn your helicopter over and fold in your two base pieces. Then fold down the other blade. Add some tape around the bottom to secure the base pieces and a little bit at the top. Now let's add on our weight. I'm using a paper clip. Experiment with different weights or no weights at all. Right, let's take it for a spin. Get yourself up somewhere nice and high, like I have. Hold your helicopter like this and get ready to drop it. Three, two, one. Wow, that's weird. Look at how the air rushing past the blades is making the helicopter spin. Okay, I put a fan underneath to make it float like this, but it's a great way to show you how it works. Airflow is moving slower across the bottom of the blades and faster across the top of the blades, creating lift. Right, let's turn this off. Another way to increase the spin on your helicopter is to twist the blades. Try experimenting by twisting them different amounts and directions. Let's try dropping them again. Look at that spin! You can see how lift slows down the paper helicopter as it falls. It's the same science that makes planes and helicopters fly. Try making bigger or smaller size helicopters and use different paper to see what happens. 